Shut up and sit down. Gandhi Jayanti speech. Speech on Gandhi Jayanti for students and children in English. Good morning, everyone. My name is X Y Z, and uh, we have gathered here to celebrate the birthday of Mahatma Gandhi. This is Gandhi Ji's one fiftieth birth anniversary. Because of his struggle for India's independence, Neta Ji Subhash Chandra Bose gave him the name of Father of the Nation. Also, sometimes we call him Bapu. In India, Gandhi Jayanti is celebrated every year on second October to pay a tribute to him, who devoted his life to India's independence by using his strong weapon, non-violence. Not only in India, in fact, in the whole world, but this day is also celebrated as International Day of Non-Violence. Gandhi Jayanti is celebrated to remember Gandhi Ji's principles of peace and non-violence, and to educate and inspire the present generation. The contribution made by Gandhi Ji to make India an independent country. He has gone through a long struggle so that the people of India can breathe in an independent nation. He was a devotee of truth and non-violence. Satya and Ahimsa ke pujari. In his honor, the UN General Assembly has announced this day as the International Day of Non-Violence on 15th June 2007. Every year, Gandhi Jayanti is feasted at Rajghat, Delhi, and our Prime Minister, along with the President of India, gathers here to pay the tribute by offering flowers to his samadhi. Also, his favorite song "Raghupati Raghav Raja Ram" is sung for him. All the schools, colleges, private offices, and government organization remains closed on this national holiday. Gandhi Ji's full name was Mohandas Karmachand Gandhi. He was born in a small coastal town of Gujarat, known as Porbandar, in 1869. He was an honest man and truth lover. In 1888 he completed his law in the UK and then shifted to South Africa to practice it. After 21 years he started with peaceful civil disobedience or satyagraha. After coming back to India with ahimsa non-violence he fought for the freedom of India from the British rule. It is because of him and other national freedom fighters India got freedom from 200 years of slavery. Gandhi ji being such a great leader preferred to wear khadi clothes. He never accepted British culture and always followed the old traditional culture of India. He always encouraged the people of India to have faith in themselves and fight for their rights. He asked the Indians to not to serve the british and fight for their freedom it is because of his devotion and struggle that india is a free bird today gandhi ji spent a major part of his life to get freedom for our country he joined gopal krishna gokhale who was already struggling for india's independence during this struggle gandhi ji has to go jail several times He has led to many important movements, such as the Quit India movement, civil disobedience movement, and non-cooperation movement. Also, he started Dandi March or Salt Satyagraha in 1930 and walked for 400 kilometers. Quit India was a call to Britishers to leave India and go. He did great works all through his life which still has an impact on the people in this modern era. He has worked with great effort to achieve swaraj to remove untouchability customs from society, the eradication of other social evils, empowering women's rights, developing the economic condition of farmers and many more. Many leaders and freedom fighters have also contributed their part in getting India's independence such as Azad 
Bhagat Singh, Rajguru, and many more. They have fought till the death has touched their feet and taking them to heaven. In the history of India, these national freedom fighters along with Gandhiji will always be remembered. India finally got its independence on 15th August 1947 and we celebrate this day as Independence Day every year.